Tonight on the Party Poker Premier League Poker 4, it's the match that everyone's been waiting for. It's Ego versus Ego as Tony G and Phil Helmuth hit the table. Alongside Daniel Negreanu, none of them are safe from the relegation zone and they're going to have to fight past each other in the league to get in contention for a final table place. I'm trying to build a poker mansion. I'm trying to become the greatest poker player of all time. I'm going to punish you, I promise. Some people in life are just trying to tear my mansion down. They should be building their own mansion. When you put a target on your back, I'm gonna throw darts at it. Is Phil doing zoom, 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 vroom, vroom, vroom? Or is he on lockdown mode? I can't figure out, really, if he's just lying to the public to try to pretend that he's the best for some marketing reasons, or that he's just delusional enough to think that he is. To not get much respect from my peers is comical. I'm like, what? They don't think I can play? Are you kidding? You gotta stay positive, you gotta stay positive. You know what I'm saying? Right, but so what? Phil Helmuth's an interesting character. You know, he overrates his game significantly. Some people want to kind of chop me down at my knees so they can stand on my shoulders and say, look at me. I've outplayed you every time we've played. You wear rose-colored glasses, my friend. He's proven year in, year out that he's one of the worst players in the Premier League, and he's just very fortunate to hang on. You should be, I mean, you shouldn't even be allowed to play. You're beyond dumb. Well. I guess maybe one of us is dumb, Tony. I'm not sure, sure who it is, so. He's got a style that works very well against weak players. But how much hit one? Yeah! The problem is the Premier League doesn't have any bad players, and everyone already is, you know, sort of on to his strategy. So he really needs to kind of figure out a new way to play the game and, and get a little more advanced, because the simplistic view that he has of the way the game's played is just, it's, it's 1989. There seems to be a lot of needling going on still, and <laughs> honestly, I don't know how you're taking it so well. Um, what are your plans going in today to deal with this, the needling? Well, I mean, in the old Premier Leagues, they would actually, they'd actually meet before to, to try to be able to needle me the maximum, which was, <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's a true story, actually. I don't think that my ego is going to get involved. I don't think that uh, anybody's going to be able to affect me. I'm going to kind of enjoy their attempts. If I respond to any of their needling, any of their serious needling, then it's a sign of weakness on my part. Daniel's the, creative enough to come up with a needle that I'll respond to and have fun with, but, but somebody like Tony G is gonna be too brutal, and I'm not even, he, won't, he won't even get a response, and that won't be as much fun for him, but you know, I'm here to win today. I mean, I'm here to play great and hopefully win, let's put it that way. Have you been doing your homework then? Are you working up on, you know, figuring out the right kind of needle to get at him? Are you thinking about it? You know, to be honest with you, if he doesn't blow up, it's no fun. I mean, the whole point of needling him is to watch his, the, the smoke come out of the ears and hear the, oh, you guys, you guys know I have 11 bracelets. That's the whole point of needling him, to get him to go nuts, because it makes for great TV. And I love watching it. I guys sit at home with my popcorn. I'm like, look at Helmuth. Oh, watch, look at this, the king on the river. Watch this, he's going to explode. Smoke, oh, God. you hear what he just said? <laughs> this is too good. It's great stuff, so, you know, I'm here to entertain myself first and foremost but if he's not going to uh, if he's not going to react then gosh it's going to be really boring <laughs> no you can get me to react you, you okay. just have, you know can't be i mean you're you're going to be right. clever enough to get we'll me to try. react we'll those try. guys those guys want to get so negative that if i respond to their criticisms about you know whatever they're going to say then it shows weakness you and i can have some fun i mean okay. we you might need me all you we want. might even end up heads up today he you even never called know. me ugly on a show you believe that oh. that was a weird one Oh, Ugly? Well, there should be a lot for us to watch here today. We've got the luck in the commentary booth with Jesse May, so good luck, guys. All right. Did I call you ugly? <laughs> yeah, you did. Four league matches have been played. We're starting to see some spread on the points table. In the top zone, Josefina and JC Tran in action. In the playoff zone, Yevgeny Timoshenko and Luke Schwartz in action. Luke Schwartz, a stronger position based on his game in hand but it's the relegation zone. That's the battle all four of these bottom players playing today, and we're gonna start to see it shaping up. They need to score or their Premier League dreams will fade. Particular pressure on Ian Fraser. This is his last match. All the players in today checking out what they need to do in the last two matches. Falling out of control. Falling out of control, yeah. <laughs> Negreanu's in full flow with his lock impression. Like, I got three wins, like eight, four, six points, three, like, I get a third, well, you flip it, there's like three, chop, chop, chop. So, the surfing on a board, the board flips, people, random. So, there's this, and then it's like 13% uh, Unagi. That's what I'm, I mean, you know? It's like crazy, right? <laughs> Why did you do that? Now over to your commentary team of Jesse May and Phil Lock. Players coming on now for this fifth match. Yeah. Gangsta style. So. You just got, there's such a buzz in the air. I mean, that line of Phil Helmuth 
sitting next to J.C. Tran, and he'll be on J.C.'s left. The promise of a war. Cards will be in the air, and Phil Locke. Now, I see you've got some papers over there. You've got eight pages of math. What have you come up with as far as the scoring goes? Well, I'm not 100% done, but it's amazing. If you really wanted to just, you could fold every hand, and I calculated that you could go about a, you could get to the 20, 40 level, assuming no one died, and still have like 108,000 at chips left. It was obvious. It was obvious. Playing tight is right in these formats. The first 20 to 60 hands. Be changed. Oh. It, it should be to where it, you know. It, it's sometimes it's obvious if a guy's like trying to raise or, or accidentally putting in. You know what I mean? People are like, oh no, he puts in a bigger chip. And the problem is, if everybody else calls it, <coughs> then you almost have to call it. You know. So this pot raised up by JC Tran. Fraser's called with the same <coughs> hand, and Negrano with a chance to take mm -hmm. off a flop mm -hmm. for four. He raised thirty-one thousand. He squeezed. Oh, he squeezed. See, I don't, well, it's tough. Now look what you do. I fold ace queen, you know? It's like, it's really hard to play aggression. Aggression is so beautiful. And I mean, let's see if there's so many shots. And I mean, why did Negrana, why did Negrana do this? What, what's like up? Like, he doesn't even benefit Well, if he thinks he can get to the first guy, he feels he can just plow to the rest of them. Over. Wow, what if Ian's on to this? I'll be just super impressed. Wow, he's on to it. He is. Good for him, you know? Good for him. And I mean, the only idea, the only way you could be on to this, Phil, is if you decide that Daniel's strategy is to come out of the gates fast. That's true, right? Yeah. yeah. I run, I run good like that. I run into I feel like that was a smooth move. He's come in here with the red power shirt, Ian Fraser. Knows he needs points. And that's, that was courageous. I think Fraser is feeling very free in his game tonight. You know, just get out there and play. Yeah. Yep. It's good for him. I hope that we get to see Bubblegum do some, uh, like, 6-4-5 betting today. You know? <laughs> it's like you, were, uh, you were really up for it with it with the last match. You guys were going at it. Yeah, that was so much fun. This king-queen, I, I have a whole new respect for this hand. <laughs> we raise 18,000. Strong stuff by Giovanni. And... He's sort of got the chip position, you know, sorry, the position in the league, Phil, to be making these kind of pressure moves, doesn't he? Yep. I've noticed one, one thing, this is the first time I've seen Safina's cards while he plays, but he really, if he has a hand he's going to call with, he raises. Because yeah. a hand good enough to call with is often enough good enough to raise. Look, he's going to win this hand. Through, he's going to, ace nine's going to fold. The, the fives might set pedal, but he doesn't. And I wouldn't either. Because you don't know if the first guy is going to raise you. Well, everything comes into play. I mean, Giovanni's three betting range throughout this Premier League has been quite narrow, but maybe he feels like he can open it up. I want Dan and Negrano to start talking to Phil Hemmuth about his blog, and, and, uh, because I just know it's going to be a good thread. <laughs> It's not enough to needle. The needle has to be well timed, and I think all these guys are Phil sitting right. there saying nothing, helmet. But as soon as he loses a pot, <laughs> that's when straight right. in. You're right. It's all about timing. You can't. <sighs> and okay. wow, the three bet is just all over this match. No way! What was that? Did he have 9-5 off suit? He's, he's got nothing! <laughs> Look at that! Phil wow. Helmuth! Play the game, baby! Oh my lord, this is just brilliant. Play the game, baby! That's beautiful. He came in this morning and he said, Peace, exercise, moment, and meditation. Now it sounds a little hokey, but, <laughs> but it sure sounds like a guy that's not going to do something crazy with nine five, you know. So he's already played the game before he arrived to the table. Oh, it's brilliant. This is why I like just playing tight in the first twenty one hands. Just fold them, just because. Guess what? When you finally play a hand, you might be able to play it for a lot and win a lot. I just love that, you know, Luke Schwartz in the very opening of the league. He did that sort of five bet all in shove with a four six, and everyone was talking about it. And Helmuth and Negrano are like, you know. 
We've seen that before. We can do that. Here's a little bit. It's scary, did I feel? <laughs> oh. Scary, hang on, hang on. Don't get too excited yet. Wow, I Fraser it. just said to Phil Helmut, he looks scary today, and he Happy. does. He looks powerful. Happy, Happy winner, show us a smile. Let's see, uh, Ian's got, the, the stacks, look at this, the stacks are all pretty much the same, 230 to 330. That's, but it is, it is a so pretty big hit to go from 700 to 230, I mean 600 to 230 actually. So you, haven't got, you haven't got but the Chase carriage right now. Chase is yeah, so we're not pulled off from from Helmuth, oh. and they'll be head out. Oh, cool, this is great, because they have, have history, a lot of history. They're too good of a player to be all in. What do you think I had against Daniel when I re-raced him? 50 Doesn't matter. Play the hand. I don't want to. I was loose. I'd like the ace queen suited. That's the most. <laughs> <story. laughs> <It's> destroyed. <laughs> God, I think it's better if Phil just doesn't say anything. Me too. <coughs> now, I think check. This is a good check. I think he's looking at calling. He has a real hand. The chance that Helmuth has. Let's cement that too. You're really only against the flush draw. If Helmuth had Ace King, wouldn't he re-raise, or would he really play it? So you know, I think this is just a call. You're really, of course, trying to hit a nine or a ten. You're trying to dodge the Ace Queen, or I mean, it's a big test for Helmuth here, isn't it? Because it's like JC has just sort of got his his mind all skewed, and JC knows that. That's why he's playing. He's playing that nine defensively, isn't he? Yeah, they all, I mean, also Helmuth is doing the right thing. He looks like. Just be a rag king for Tran. I take. I would take the line of check call here. But if you bet, the nice thing is your opponent will get to see what you had. He's bet small. He's bet nine five thousand. Unlucky son. Wow. You just said nine ten's good. Nine ten it is. Is he gonna show it? Jesse's pretty honest when he says something. That's Weak. Should have. It was a mistake. I told myself I can't call you all that's, day. That's why I bid three thousand. Well, you really think I had when I made it fifty thousand? Do you think I had as good as ten high that hand? <laughs> really? I don't know. I didn't have as good as ten high. I'm you know, not you're thinking. Gonna that. You're going to know help anyway. Himself. He can't tell himself. Uh, you see, this is a mistake. I didn't even have I ten high. Just ten high had me crushed when I made it fifty. Okay. <laughs> morons. Okay. Jesus. Can, can we morons. Can we morons. Can we morons. Get steaming. <laughs> I'm steaming. I'm steaming. I'm proud. Can we get a free steaming? Yeah. Yeah. He made I'm a few thousand and they didn't know that he had air. You know? I mean, he's steaming because they're not giving him credit for like, oh, they're steaming because they're not saying you're a genius, Phil. That steams him up. Just that. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. We can side bet what I had. I'm telling you, I can't be. I can't be 10 high. And if I had 9 or 8 high, it wasn't even a good 9 or 8 high. It was an awful nine well, or eight. Really wants credit. <laughs> like the nine six suited. But I mean, suited? Can, can I get a free roll? Can oh. Phil and I get a free you roll? You think Phil's I had a good? Phil's in the booth going, I want a free roll on that. I had worse <laughs> than nine six suited. Is right. what I had. That's actually a lucky hand. You know, Helmet would be like the best in the world. If <laughs> I had the Dolly Parton hand. Working nine two five. Did that nine five off? Have you just played brilliant. You take him out for a while, let him cool down. That's a shocker. I mean, he's actually steamed that he can't get a bet that he was bluffing. I mean, he's played the first twelve hands of this match. I'm saying nine five just to mess up your heads. And now what if he unravels? How about that, Tony? <laughs> no, I mean, I, I misplayed a hand against JC. He's raising every pot, too. and I just called him with the ace six suited. Yeah. So bad. Why is wow. Tony just making 20? He got away with the queen 10. Pot man. control, it's the first 21 hands. There's nothing wrong with oh, the pot small. It's not a super monster, it's a drawing <laughs> hand. Your opponent can have queens, whatever. You're going to raise, you're going to like. I've done this sometimes. Like, and you know, I guess he could, it might pick up a squeeze behind yeah, him, yeah, too, and that sort of thing, like Fraser did. Yep. Yeah, by the way, could he pick up a squeeze? Yeah, he could easily, because JC Tran, had, that's true, could pick up a squeeze. This is an, it, this is an excellent moment, because we love when there's confrontations, and we have, <laughs> for sure there's going to be the, the, the top pair and the flush draw are going to have a little something. I mean, Safina usually sort of calls with these things, but just because... Oh, does he? I hadn't been watching. He's a, he takes the free cards and keeps it small. That's good. I like that. I'm just wondering if you were Safina now, if you'd if you'd rather sort of put pressure on Tony no G because of his chip, his uh, league. No way. Draws are to be called, and free cards. Though it's ABC poker. 
this is uh this is a good card. Actually if if Tony were to check well, Tony X second, Tony's always gonna bet here. Bet fairly big too. Thirty thousand into forty four. And I like this fold. You know, you're you're trying to get that card on the turn. Tony G has he really has nothing's gone right for him so far. You guys both insta mucked and both said it had to be a monster. And I, and I you know, I just, I forgot that they, I, I didn't realize that you were going to get to see it before the end of the match. So I just, I let Roland talk about what an easy lay down it was for you guys with the ace 10 and the ace jack. Well, I fought the ace 10 because I felt like I was beat somewhere. Six. I didn't mean, say it was you. I, I was beat I see. in a different spot. Same thing this hand. I mean, I wouldn't say anything, but. He can't help himself. Let's party, kid. Going on, buddy. Let's party, kid. I mean, uh, I came to party. <laughs> <laughs> now you missed it, Tony. After you went eliminated, I went crazy that, in that heat. I raced ten out of eleven pots. Re-race with re-race with no, I, I, I blew myself <laughs> up. I saw he made a good call there. I, I had bottom pair on him is what I had, and uh, and uh, and I just didn't follow through. You made a I bet every street, but I just didn't move in, because I forgot that he was capable. You forgot to pull the trigger. Yeah, <laughs> forgot to pull the trigger. You forgot to pull the trigger. I give him credit, though. Wanna, I, mean. I get a bottle of wine, you might loosen up a bit. Raise the 7,000. Some people need wine, you know, to, to help their games. You need to get your logo on, man. Eh? Here comes sure. Giovanni. Holy cow. <laughs> it's so cold. It's funny. I, yeah, know. Another I like the call. Oh, he re raised. Yeah, I don't mind just calling Jax. I kind of started to treat Jax like pocket five. So much pain. When the guy calls, you're just sick. <laughs> and when he raises, you're even more sick because you've turned a real hand into it. But you know, JC's a better player than me, I think. So maybe I should start raising my Jax. <laughs> Luke, you've been like the quietest so far, man. Yeah, queen uh -oh. two off all day. Oh, dude, he's, calling you out. he's calling you out, kid. I'm calling him out. Why would I do that? I like Luke. Like I noticed he was quiet too. I didn't want to say anything. If I had anything suited or anything playable. No, I just mean you haven't said much so far. <laughs> Not much to say. Yeah. yeah. I've run into it. Well, I think with this lineup, we have seen a lot of beautiful e. poker in the Premier League. Yep. It's been eye-opening. Four out of the top By ten the way, hands. I yeah. like this. Uh, you know, Luke hasn't played many, if any, hands, so why not open for 6,000? But well, look at JC just doesn't stop when he has a real hand. Now, you'd never want to call out of position with a suited in this spot, so... If you're sta if you have a big enough stack, let's see, he has 300. Yeah. It's not the end of the world yeah. calling here, but you don't know if you want to hit an ace. And if the guy's ace king, it, when you hit your two, it doesn't look so happy. Pretty hard hand for Luke to play out of position, isn't it? It's super hard. Check. I think it, I, I wouldn't mind taking a free card here. Yeah. Flush draw for Schwartz, and he's hit it right in the home run zone. We've heard Luke say how much he wants to own J.C. Tran. This is a good start. It's going to be really hard for Tran to do anything here but call call, right? I mean, yeah, it's gonna be how call, is he going to get away from this on the river? He won't. Uh, I mean, if an ace comes, he can fold. Okay, so that's his fold card. That's a bad card for Luke. Is he going to go big? Everybody knows Schwartz is capable of the double barrel bluff. Yep. That's 100. And wow, look at JC. I mean, insta muck. I know he's got jacks, so I've got to do <coughs> something to like <laughs> over bet or under bet or something. <laughs> well, Schwartz had the best hand and he's the chip leader, but JC Tran must feel like his play is an open book right now. Quickly recapping that the V chip guys with the highest number of voluntarily yeah. putting Sometimes chips in the pot have the like lowest chip stack. <laughs> I'm telling you, you got to play tight in the first 40, in 20 to 40 hands. Tight is right. Language tight is right. Had 10 events on. Your writers aren't always the nicest to me, but. 
God. I would play this. I don't interfere at all in the writing. And Card Player Magazine, which I own a big binder. piece of. Their, their writers are kind of tough on me, too. I'm like, I own a piece of it, but I don't say anything. Yeah, I own a piece of the magazine, they make fun of me. We don't like, we just write about it. You know? Like, Ilse do, we, we gave them the same. We gave you guys a very hard time. Really hard time. Yeah. We, we don't care. We're not going to get paid. It's all right. And Helmut's having to think here. <laughs> To now is his just by the way the one thing that I do like about these sort of plays is you, you're gonna narrow the hand down to probably you and the guy that opened it uh, look at he's also getting he got eights to fold but um and he feels that he might just have uh, edge over an unknown player to him so post flop having position you know he's probably trying to just create that situation and then Cool. Bill, this this game has such a different uh, super weird texture. Yeah, yeah. different tempo. Bill Helmuth trying to just win with anything. Let's see how did he do. Well, not good. Mostly because his opponent has top pair, top okay. kicker. Yeah, Phil's check this. He needs the nine for the straight, ten for two pair. The eight, he's got outs. It's the good sort of hand to just check. check. By the way, he might bet here putting his opponent on ace jack. But he's getting called. I mean, cool. Paul, keep the pot small. And it's going to be very difficult for Phil to win this pot without getting the best hand. Yeah, very hard. Check. Check. How do you think Tony G's feeling right now about his pocket eights? And by the way, Hilma, Hilma will probably just check. Maybe his hand's good. Yeah, well, he did check, yeah. We turned the heat oh, up a little. Tony G, Why? sick <laughs> as a dog. He knows he could have made nice some hand. chips that hand. You know, you do At least you've been doing a lot of raising. Hasn't got you anywhere. He's still, well, still you, losing you chips. Winning or not winning? He's losing. I've outplayed you every time we've played. Yeah, you So far, but it could all turn around for you. You wear, you wear rose colored glasses, my friend. Just haven't got, you haven't got the courage right now. Yeah. You're not prepared to die. You don't want to look bad. You want to slowly lose the chips. I know where it is. I know how it is. You're too good of a player to be all in. It is going to be one heck of a battle. I can still be there. They, they got to kick me, and they got to they got to finish me off. I'm not finished off yet. Every decision is going to count. It, it's it's almost like playoff time. I'm the best player here. It's, it'll be a joke if I don't win. I usually bring my A game out when you know I need I need a big finish like this. Let's get out there and get some chips, eh? <laughs> so that was the plan, right? With that. Welcome back to Premier League Four Poker 4 in Las Vegas. Yeah. <laughs> that last hand, I mean, I think it's going to affect Tony G more than anybody. He's steamed. Yeah, yeah. He's, 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 he's looking at the theoretical potty with a one. He's muttering to himself. He knows he's going to have to do something here. And, and Everyone is aware now that it's not just them that have come in with different game plans. Everybody has come in here with a different yeah. game plan. At least yep. it wasn't the insta three bet, you know? Look at JC. How smooth I is might this? Have. Smooth call yep. over kings. Thinking Sony might do something. It is the, the energy's been right with it. Just sort of like ultimate awareness that somebody's going to three bet this, but nobody has. You know. Let's see how does how does the play work out? It's always interesting to see. It's a item. If everyone checks, Kings will, of course, get comfortable again, but... If, if it is checked... That's 15,000. Wow. What a bet by Daniel. He's he's opened this pot for the raise. Oh, oh. Hey, I won a pot. That's sweet. It's fun. I might have called it a 4-7, yeah. trying to 4-7, but my opponent on the ace king. I, <coughs> but I would only call that one, one bit. You got your zoom zoom on today, huh, Phil? <coughs> the zoom zoom. Well, it's like a fake job, you know. So you're just gonna really play tight, but you're faking that you're playing loose. Is that what you're doing? Uh, I haven't had anything yet. I've raced with nothing every time I've raced or re-raced every single hand, except I I hit something I when queens, it came queen jack queens, eight. Queens, kings, ace king, queens, jacks, tens, and ace king. Except when it came queen jack <laughs> eight, I'm gonna like raise it up. Me. I'm gonna make it uh, <laughs> six. Six thousand. Except when it came queen jack eight, I actually flopped a pretty big hand there. But I checked behind I him. I had two eights that I like his call here. 
Oh, you By the way, filled up. the reason why I would never race here is because you're. Have aces and kings? This is a nice hand. It's a crowbar hand, and maybe some yeah, other people will call after you. <laughs> I'm serious. Uh, however, you when you raise these sort of hands, what you do is you create a really like a queen, sharp o opportunity for you to have position against one player, Are you which is how <laughs> you want most of your pots to be in Nolan and Hold'em. Your chance of just picking it up with the C bet goes way through the roof because your opponent is only a third to connect. Break time comes like a lion out there. Wow, he's and wearing his heart on his sleeve. <laughs> if he probably calls, that's bad to. Obviously, he doesn't yeah. have a pair of jacks with that sort of energy. You know, Ian knows that. He should go back to being a cave in a cave right now. If he folds, it's okay to chat, I think. I think sometimes I'll find myself folding after I thought for too long. I'm like, well, what if I connect? I'll never get paid. They know that I've got a, a weird 5 8. You know what I'm saying? So interesting because, I mean, Phil Helmuth, he's been opening so many hands that he'd half expect to be three bet by Fraser here. You know, that's just the next play, right? Right. Yep. So, what does he want to do about it? Well, you can really frustrate. I mean, might as well do that. It's not good. Nothing grosser than getting called, you know? Ian doesn't feel good when Helmuth calls. But I don't mind the bet. It's suited <laughs> had hands I've raised with nine five offsuit. Doesn't matter, but that's when you still can't win. You know queen the game eight. has moved on from you. Queen nine. <laughs> You've been left behind. You're doing all you can. <laughs> I have to say no, this is already no, this is no, one no, of the no, greatest matches I've ever seen. I am yeah. so excited, Phil. One of the young kids. I'm gonna pop it up with kings in a minute. Like one of the young <laughs> kids. Just look at Tim Chung with a smile. <laughs> That's what I love about Phil. He refuses to acknowledge them by their name. Right. You one know? of the young kids. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to give them the credit of letting them know that I know their name. Negrano V. Tron. It's under the gun. There we go. Suited. And JC Tran, who's actually faced quite a bit of adversity so far this evening just sort of the, the mark of how good he is he's still got 260,000 and these guys seem zoned in I mean who's the most zoned in as far as exactly where the game is at um I like the invisible to Mashanko right now because I think being invisible is correct you don't want to they I haven't heard anything oh we can get you in if you want definitely not to get tight okay I didn't I was supposed to actually ask you never mind I forgot Da, 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 I just da, da, like the guy who cool. played the least hands cool. right Phil, now. You know I just I love that. You should, you should stop checking yeah. behind. You should yeah. stop checking yeah, the back. Yeah, that's Schwartz and Tim Oshenko right now. Yeah, You're absolutely right. It feels kind of weird. Keep doing it hey, guys, time. can I play? Oh. No, 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 it's okay. I, I, it's, I'm oh. supposed to be making this thing. Anyway. Finally, you said something. And I checked behind him, too. Finally, you said something clever. Thank you, Tony. I appreciate it. My goodness. the 12 I agree with you. Yeah, it takes you a long time to do to, to tell the truth, I think. See, I'm trying to help Heads you out. Up. I want you to improve. Thank you. Thank you. No, I appreciate it. I, see, that's good advice. Yeah. Man, yeah. I mean, all those words so far. you, you got to come up with, it's, it's, you know. got a one-man walking rule, Ian. I don't want you to get in trouble. Blind on blind. Oh, never mind. Okay. Some people don't know the rules. Yeah. <laughs> don't and the ground who hits. That's 16,000. Easy pass, I would peel call one off. Call. It looks like ace jack, ace queen, I don't know. Meanwhile, you're dead. See, I, don't, I think this is fine. Now in the turn, if he, too much if he fires, there. you yeah. pull. It's not like you're trying yeah, to peel three, you're trying to feet. freeze him up. And from so Daniel's point of view, well his hand pair. is not fantastic right now. Right. He's thinking I could be beat by just any king. My opponent has an ace nine. Wow, I wonder See, this if is what I this is. He'll call this. But he's doing this because he thinks his opponent has ace jack, those sort of hands where he just doesn't want to give him a free hand, free card. So Daniel has to call because his hand is still under repped in a sense, or? I think it's under repped when he checks the turn. I, I wonder how much I'm being oh. colored by that I can see, but I don't think I am. I think now JC Tran's shut down in his mind. He's like, okay, I, I you know, I'm done. He actually thought the bet was going to get through on the turn. He shut down. I was playing it to you on the break, but and a uh, good pot there for Daniel. Six, 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 six standard, huh? So standard. Six people at the final table, uh, unless we got 64, which I don't think we will. But 
And, and this is like oh. invitation only? It's, yeah, kind of, but most oh. people can get in. Oh. It's, it's ESPN. There's some people on, yes, on the alternate lists, but I'll put you ahead of them because you were on the list anyway. Yeah. Yeah, it's ESPN. When is it? They announced it today. Uh, it's the NAPT's on the 20th, Bold. and it's on day four of the NAPT on the 23rd. And fold it around to Action oh, Corner. Yeah. You will. Oh, sure. There's going to be 850 players in that event. But you can't play, you can't. I can't imagine Daniel could ever, ever fold his, his button and kill Helmuth in the big one. Mm -hmm. uh, not yeah, if you watch the Poker After Dark show a couple That's weeks ball. ago here in the States. Both yeah. yeah, both ESPN. That called by JC ESPN Tran. Too. Oh, it was, uh, it was, excuse me, it's a limp in. A limp in from the ground. It went three ways. Three players. Five thousand Sort of a change of pace. Yep. And Tran yeah. with the flush draw. Check. Check. And see bet, call, fold. Bet 8,000. Now it'll be a call, fold, and then Negrano will shut down. And JC will have a chance to win it on the river, maybe? Or maybe he's going for a it race here. Queen, no, it could go down to showdown. Queen High could just win. Call. Fold. It looks like a jack, and if I'm it's the... In the Grano, I think my opponent has like a jack or whatever. I don't know. Holy cow, that's a great spade because it makes the queen high flush the second nuts instead of the third nuts. I <laughs> 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 <Skip> up. <laughs> I wasn't going to bluff no more. I didn't want to do nothing. I'll just that's let you take it. That's pretty good. good. Yep. Really I, good. The guy named Bobby <laughs> really Hawk used three? to do that. <laughs> like when the turn <laughs> came <laughs> up, he would pull out a turn. B6. Muck out a turn, six. heads up. Just surrender to the power of JC <laughs> Trey. That's respect, too. I haven't made that play in a while. <laughs> Super advanced. <laughs> I haven't seen you do that one in a while. I've seen you do it, though. Yeah. On the turn, once I bet, and the guy called me, and the board was like, yeah, eight, five, five. Yeah. <laughs> and just folded. Just keep dealing. Keep dealing. Don't worry. It's not a big deal gonna happen all the time. And these guys seem zoned in. I mean, who's the most zoned in as far as exactly where the game's at? Um, I like the invisible to Mashenko oh. right now because I think being invisible is correct. Show the heart and the commitment to limp in from the one hole, huh? Yeah. The heart and the commitment. <laughs> That's his line. Happy, happy yeah, to limp. commitment. Phil, Ray Tim Oshenko, this is so dollars. typical of him. Just punish the limps no matter what. Wow. Look at this. This is going to be great. Nines, queens. Call. If Safina's just called Timoshenko's wow. raise. Oh, you're going to get a lot call. of callers with some of these hands, though. Sure I was folding this Ace, hand. Ace 10, Ace 7 of hearts. These people are just calling, you know? See, in Poker After Dark, I'd walk over to the camera and I'd be able to tell them Maybe that drama out of it. I'd, I'd, I'd be able to say, opera this is the hand away. I'm afraid of, this is the hand yeah. I'm not afraid of. I'd be able to give that whole but speech. instead, you're just going to fold. <laughs> yeah, instead, I'm just going to fold. <laughs> fold. Like lay down. I would have called. I, I think called. that's a call with that many people in the hand. I would have called if they turned out. Such a Do such it. a chance yeah, of hitting right. a, Four a home run flop. Oh, right. gonna make me Five, sick. six, seven, two clubs. Wow. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think? Oh, you man, for I much? cannot wait. Yeah. Hello. Oh my lord. This Safina. is like check. Safina will probably check. check. There's no cards he's worried about. I mean, in theory, yeah. there's straight draws out there, but essentially, he's hoping somebody hits a ten or a nine for an underset. Oh, that'd be such a great check. I would have checked. By the way. When in doubt, bet, bet if you have a hand, dollars. because it's going to be right over 90% of the time. Full. Unless you have quads or something like that. And, I mean, how tough a spot is it for Tony G? Yeah, it's easy. It looks like ace-queen. Or, or uh, Full. you know, because he called the raise. Wow. To wow, and this is why it's never so wrong to just bet your monsters, because this sort of thing can happen. See, uh, Timochenko created a branch in his head where my opponent has a queen, and he's good enough to fold, and now he's going to hang himself. I think Safina has really yeah. thrown these guys for a loop. I couldn't believe yeah, he smooth call with the queens. It's come perfect. I mean, that's great. Let me, let me 
call. Good. He just calls. That's a really important call there. If you raise, you give your opponent a chance to get away from aces, which is what Safina's probably thinking his opponent has. Aces are kings. This is a huge moment for Giovanni Safina. Let's see a king roll off. That would be so sick. <laughs> he has outperformed these oh players my Lord, every a straight step. draw. Yeah. Wow. I wonder if Timoshenko feels like he has to go all in. He's only got just over a pot-sized bet behind. Really? How much does he have left? It's 230. And the pot has 204. He might just ship it. And he's out if, if his opponent calls. But the thing is, the flat call, Timoshenko is sharp. Yo, but Phil, he's only got 16 points. If he gets a bagel here, there's a very real possibility he doesn't even make the final eight. Oh, my Lord. Wow. Check. <clears throat> Do you think maybe Timoshenko's just finally realized that he's actually under more pressure than Giovanni Safina? I, you know what I mean? Yeah. Safina's yep. got 21 points. Yep. He doesn't care. Safina's for sure betting something. It's Timoshenko's. Look at this. I love this bet. It looked like 70. 70,000. Oh, Lord, that's perfect. Timoshenko's forced to call. Chop those chips into your pot, you know? Come on. He's gone all in. all in. He's done. He is in so much ball. trouble. He, he might be out of the Premier oh League. Lord. Wait till he sees these oh, three queens. But you know what? He's still wow. nearly 20%. What happened? Wow. He's got nines and aces. And that's wow. it. This is huge for my side, Matt. I had zero outs until he probably could last longer with him. I wow, mean, this could point. change everything if a nine or an ace rolls off. Okay. He's made some of the most impressive plays Close. of the entire Premier League. Six. And now he's blown he's out. Blind. He's blown out. Blind. He will not be at the, the final Russian table, part. right? Wow. Not for still, sure. No, he could, he he could, could still make do it. the final eight. Yeah, the but with okay. a bagel. Yeah. A bagel is zero, right? That's yeah. The, yeah. With zero points. And he's, yeah. he, he's now he's still going to have some chips left. I think maybe four or five thousand. I think he had the king king. And yeah, Giovanni saying, putting you on the two kings. Yeah. This internet wow, qualifier, this it. online from Italy, he made a really out of the box play, didn't he? Yep. Oh, wow, that was just insane. And Timoshenko yeah, needs a miracle. Like 4,000 4, chips. Like this would be the sickest comeback. It's so weird. Sometimes I can know when I'm going to get there, I know when I'm going to King Jack, right? <laughs> you know, all the guys there's talking now, yeah. there's been a couple of them who <laughs> haven't really been worrying about their points. Some are thinking about nothing else. And it's just going to, that's going to just start building and building. Bold. Call. At least he didn't call all in. He's checking. <laughs> Check. He went all in. Did you look yet? <laughs> I think we got to get the track. Doesn't deserve a bike. Give him a bike. Bring him the bike. Get the bike out. A couple of spades, and it is Timoshenko bike. all in right yeah. here. He had the heart and commitment and to make a big if he can make this hold, the bike. The bike. Yep. The bike. he deserves a bike. Okay. He just, he deserves <laughs> it'd, be a, it'd be a quadruple up. He has to dodge a Look spade. Look at this, Phil. You could be on that track. It's a monkey on it. <laughs> Tony's it's bringing out the bets. Timoshenko's last match in the Premier League. No, I think Timoshenko deserves a bike. It's too good for the track. <laughs> <laughs> They're bringing it's out the out. bike. Ah, uh, the trike's for Phil Helmuth. Reserve, the monkey's on top of it. Have a look, Phil, behind you. It's your trike. It's going it's on, let's see this turn. You need a oh, okay, he's drawn dead now. <coughs> Get the bike out. He's a good board. He's, he's smiling. Oh, wow. Spade, smiling. Spade, the spade comes in. A spade might, 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 might be good. So if oh, you're yeah, Fraser, you don't bet this. You want yeah. There's no reason to. Right. I've got a queen. King turn. You got a spade? Yeah. Oh, you got it. He's got out of the house. There's a 10. You need a 10, 3. No, I saw oh. this one. Wrong. All right, yeah. All right 16 points. And <laughs> the bagel, Timoshenko seems yep. to feel that 16 points All might right. be enough Three to make four. top eight. Right. He's going to watch very yeah. interestedly. Yeah. He's, he's <laughs> over here. The he's safe with it. He's taking All the right. bike. He's he, going he on. He's going to ones who won, Will. He deserves it. He had the having commitment to make a move. I'll give you 500. You ride it through the casino. <laughs> there you go. This is a good sport, Warren. Well done. <laughs> Phil, that's a good example for you. 
That's a nice example. That's, that's probably better than the entrance the to the World Series. The train, huh? yeah. so that's probably well, better than that. Yeah. You, dude, you'll wear a freaking Caesar suit. You gotta, ride, you gotta yeah. wear yeah. that thing. Yeah, you gotta ride it for sure. Can't play poker, but we can make a show. That's the key. What a shocker. Timo Shenko out. And he's gonna have to watch from the sidelines to see if he's done enough to get to the final from here. It's only been a level. And for Safina, what a great start. I'll be pretty happy if I make it to the top eight. I, I don't think I'm a lock at the moment, but if Ian doesn't get more than six points, then I'm looking pretty good to make the top eight. Okay, well, we'll be watching to see who gets those points, and hopefully we'll see you in the heads up. Thank you very much. Thanks. There's plenty more action to come from Premier League Poker from the M Casino in Las Vegas after the break. Welcome back to Premier League Poker from the M Resort in Las Vegas. The big names in poker are struggling in the league as Phil Hellmuth, Daniel Negreanu, and Tony G all need to score points tonight to keep their Premier League dreams alive. They were, yeah, and he was against him it's too. Unlikely to get in. See, he's he's probably he, not going to make it, Daniel. Will be the play, huh? Because it's everybody's close. playing, everybody's really? playing to beat 16, 16 17. He, get, he hasn't had a second place, so anyone with a second and oh nothing. Oh my God! Yeah, so if he gets tied, I think the, the best bet for him oh, is, is for like me yeah, or, yeah. or Giovanni yeah. to finish high. So he's uh, Giovanni is safe. He's in. You know he's what I'm saying? If we finish high, we're going to lock up some of the points that you guys could have got. Yeah. And it would be better for you. I'm rooting for you two guys. The permutations are endless of where the league tables and points will go. I'd like to bet that Tim Oshenko gets in, Phil, because I'd like to bet Raised that he 12, went home he and did a lot of math up in the room you know, and has worked out that 16 yeah. is very, very likely to make the top eight. That's huge. I'll bet you 50 pounds that he doesn't make the he final. He doesn't make the final eight. Fold. Is it an APT? The main event an APT? Is that fold? Yes, piano. Folded around to Luke on the button, who's, uh, he's now been the tightest guy at the table, yep. now that Timoshenko's gone. I like this, wow, he re-raised. Oh, wow, sorry, it was Helmuth who opened. And Schwartz, Schwartz really likes that button stuff, you know. And this is a dynamic. He did that to me a bunch, too. <laughs> I didn't know about it at the time, but like, how can you call? You're just going to fold this. But Helmuth knows, yeah, he knows that Luke's been waiting to do this. Yep. And so even though, even when you know your opponents are up to it, the right thing mathematically, you just can't expose yourself to these, what, you're going to call out a position or you're going to, what, commit a ton of chips on a read? No. His timing's Luke, good. Luke is good. He won't show it because he wants to repeat the move, you know. But he will tell Phil if Phil asks. Probably. And that is why, by the way, you play tight in the first four spots. You could be our next, though. You're probably the fire. I know I still have yours, so. Okay, then I probably have yours. We can make a big side bet if you want. Yeah. <coughs> Let's make okay. a big side bet. Me and you last longer. If you have a lot more chips, I, I thought you said the favorite to go out next. I bet I'm not the favorite to go out next. I'll bet he's not the favorite to go out next. For sure. Yeah. He's a sixth place guy, not a seventh place guy. <laughs> right? <laughs> 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 hey, that was a good one, Daniel. Okay. Your favorite to be at the next oh. two, right? I mean, you must feel like that. Oh. <laughs> I don't feel like that. Are you? <laughs> you are a beautiful, uh, beautiful guy, I'll tell you that much. One of these Premier Leagues, I'm going to win like a race or two or three. You get invited. Oh. I mean, you want to finish last. Well, what is the rule? Right. Soccer, right? If you can finish in the bottom four, like how many years in a row? Heads you you, you got to go to the minor leagues and then win get yeah, in the Dale top eight. Got you need a, you need Dale Dale Fish got relegated. Dale was relegated two years in a row. They keep inviting me back, though. Oh, so you're going to be relegated next year. For sure you're going to be out. If, if, if you're bottom four, I can tell you it's yeah. finished. Your Look, career is my over. My company's on that. I mean, I've got a bit of influence. You want to bet? How much? How much you bet? I could bet a lot. How much you want to bet? Bet thirteen. I would bet twenty thousand. Can I? I want a piece of your bet. I'll bet whatever oh. you want. If you finish, if, if you, you finish, finish top four, you won't be back. If you finish I'll bottom four, you won't be back. Okay, so talking about the relegation of wow. the Premier League. Okay. 
Wow. Oh my right god, now. they're betting 10,000. Yeah, if Phil Helmuth is in the bottom four, he's betting that he'll be back <laughs> next year. No, 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 he's saying if I finish in the bottom four, yes, I won't be invited back. He hasn't finished in the bottom four yet. But if he does, I still think he would get invited back. Somehow I wouldn't be invited back because you... Are you saying I'm corrupt? That's unfair. sort of a negative confidence. Minus free roll for Phil. And he's already betting on something that'll happen if he gets finished No, not at all. He's just... He's locking up some money in the off. Nice he's turning a miserable like spot into plus EV. <laughs> if he gets the bottom four, he makes 10,000. Because why wouldn't they invite him back next year? Everyone loves to pick on him. He's won the fourth amount of money in the history of man. And he's got 11 bracelets. And he's great table banter. If he calls me and says you're invited, which, which of course he will, then you just owe me 10,000. I might not play. Have you ever seen that? An email. Put your cash. City and the Sundance oh, Kid, when, 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 when he says, <laughs> just invite me to stay and I'll go. Invite me. Just please, please, please invite him. Oh, right. That was brilliant. <laughs> Isn't that what this sounds like? <laughs> <laughs> Phil says, I might not play anyway. He just has to invite me and I won't play. <laughs> would you like to come back and play? They would just, they just put me up and say, you're playing. You're already in. <laughs> <Huh? 12, 000. laughs> you had a vacation <laughs> set out. Was getting ready to go somewhere nice. You're locked in already. Here I am. Oh. you guys. Oh. Oh. Like a four thousand bet. That's all. You should. Oh, yeah, you, you were right though. You should have locked. Oh. You should have locked me up and said that I had to. This show up Premier League has value. definitely you know, entered the league stage this, this year. year. I mean, exactly. there's so many good players now who want to get in. There's well, so much good play. Yeah, so been many been exciting characters. And this is so much of a flop. It's crazy. Holy cow! Straight draw versus. When I have ace queen of diamonds there, I feel like I can't lose the head. Helmuth just flatted for the big blind here to Fraser's race. Like, like, I think I would call this. The jack is. That's what I lost on the. Can Helmuth win this without hitting? No, I think he's gonna. I had Mario. Everything lost. We'll work on it. We'll work on models. You're not gonna get a jack to fold, so why bet? I don't bet. You're gonna win it now, anyways, Ian, but. Made a really small bet. King Jack is just going to call every day of the week. That's a big swing. Is it such a small bet you have to call with ace high? Or no. To get second to it's an easy fold. Yeah, well, two points. Call. Two nines. <coughs> Good math. It's getting out class. If I'm not mistaken, Phil, those down. are the two nines it's that Helmuth won the World Series with yeah, just okay. 21 years ago. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Remember that one on WC Europe? Phil Helmuth has pretty much won everything there is to win in poker, but never the Premier League. And he's in real danger of getting relegated now for the third time. What are you going to do out there, huh? You might have had enough equity. You got to stay positive. You got to stay positive. You know what I'm saying? But so what? So he doesn't put him on the win, so he thought he would only. He could have called, maybe. He could have just folded every hand and been better spot. Get 18 points. Can't miss. Now he might. It's called short turn. Oh, I mean, sorry. I it <laughs> the players are really debating about Timoshenko and Raise to whether or not he is going to, oh. ha how risky his move is. If he makes the top, top eight comfortably, top. it won't be that risky. If he doesn't, it's going to have been very risky. <laughs> call. Bold, bold. I like calling here. Uh, I Jacks through Man, the and down. I just call. We're and and that's because if you if you re-raise Luke here, you're kind of turning your hand into a bit of a bluff. Yeah, almost. If the guy decides to re-raise you, you're just sick, and call. you don't you you don't get to see the three player. And don't you think the fact that Luke has shown he is able to kind of make the four and five bet with nothing, <coughs> it means people realize if they start making that, they have to go with their hands right. earlier. Yeah, sure. and no one wants to do sure. it. Bet twenty-two thousand. This is a pretty good flop for a pair of nines. One over card, all low cards. Raise to fifty-two thousand. Fold and fold. I had you on every street. I had ace king, but I had you. I, we could have played all in before the flop, and then you I had just tens. huh? Tens. Pocket tens? Yeah. No, no. But I had a pocket pair, and um, maybe you would have hit an ace or king bust me. I didn't have a set. Two queens. Wow. I still like it. Yeah, you get good. It, nice, it went so. bet on the flop, right? They skate and then raise. Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. Now he gets perfectly clean information. If he gets re raised, <laughs> he shuts down. 
I was the he one in the all the overcard combo. You're the one that didn't want in the pot. Yeah. <laughs> I might have qualified. Daniel showed a little backbone there. I was kind of qualified. when he raked the pot, he said we could have played all in if you wanted to there, Luke. But you know, not was, really. I mean, so it was a little bit of bravado there. Yeah. Uh, Raised to ten thousand. Well, that's what we all do at that event. <laughs> Try and keep the game going. Call. Bold. Bold. And Daniel feeling his oats, raising the, the rush, maybe. Oh. Uh, we need it so bad. Well, you're on 14 <laughs> points. And Helmuth has not returned to the table. He's he's pacing around. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what. Talking to himself. I don't know how you can put 100k up for a tournament and start Just missing one more point. He's, he's doing laps at the table right now. You should lose a tie break. Yeah, I could just see him in the background. Yeah. He was just going yeah. by in the back there. Yeah. So you're losing the tie That's break. That's 16,000. With who? With Timoshenko. Why? Because he's had a higher You know, <laughs> Tran has not had an easy ride so far this match. He's he's had to chop, to graft. It might be a tie break. Daniel calls JC a classic chopper. You play for him? Hey. What's happening? Phil is deciding that just being here could be problematic because he might get involved and get frisky and go broke. So, He's in order to finish sixth place, he needs to walk away from the table. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he's got any positive expectations. Raised to 11. Mine's dollars. actually his best chance. Oh, <laughs> just folding every hand. He's just getting <laughs> killed in every hand he plays. He went quiet. He didn't yeah. go quiet. Fold. Well, I think Mad Marty came over to try and turn the hand over to the monitor to let the monitor see. You're now yeah. having the bike for the yeah. high roller eventually. You're gonna bring the bike? Yeah. <laughs> this now the second yeah. time. Yeah. Oh, I don't, I think that Schwartz fun. and Tran are really so mixing it up. Yeah, it's hey. gonna be. Schwartz with the three bet. JC Alexi. knows what this is about. What? Bicicleta, <laughs> bicicleta. <laughs> the Schwartz have position? Or yes. Velocipeda. Luke has the bike. No, sorry, Luke has a small blind. Velocipeda. Velocipeda. We were discussing whether you were walking away from the table was better for your sixth place opportunity or worse. It's so difficult that word is in Russian oh. compared to English, you know, just bike. Yeah. <laughs> and Bicycle. Luke is doing this the is silent, okay. deadly thing hand. tonight. Phil, he hasn't picked up any hands. He's increased his chip stack. Yep, winning without hands. Key in poker. Bye -bye. Welcome back to Las Vegas, where Premier League oh, Poker 4 is well <laughs> underway. Some You've offered me that before. Bill Helmuth not going to be giving up cool. this Premier cool. League cool. battle. Cool. You play nine ball. Yeah, I play snooker. Well, we can play. I can play it, but we'll you'll just destroy me. I mean, you'll absolutely destroy oh. me. Oh. Oh. Well, okay. you have to give me a start if we play nine ball. Oh, <laughs> I don't play nine ball or eight ball. I play snooker. Oh, snooker. All right, well, oh. you have to give me like a 30, 40 point start. <laughs> 30, 40 <laughs> point start. <laughs> Yeah, okay. You raised the 10, right? Okay, good luck. Thank All you, right. thank you. This could okay. be the we'll final hand. Clock. Jack, six oh. of diamonds? No, no. no. Right. You? No, you have a deuce <laughs> or four in there again? <laughs> are, you getting, are, you getting, are you getting freaky with this? Yeah. <laughs> Is Phil doing zoom, 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 vroom, vroom, vroom? Or is he on lockdown mode? That's the question. Oh, <laughs> Jack, six of diamonds, checks. <laughs> oh, sure. no. I think you're going to beat me for the biggest pot of your life. Right here. <laughs> I'll never ever fold this hand, ever. No matter what the heck comes off. What Five, is it? six. Well, ever. Four. I don't care what comes on the turn. I'm not folding. Cool. Oh. I don't care. Yeah, you are. Shh, don't tell him. Aside from all the banter, Three. check calling is the One play time. here all the way, right, for Daniel? Yeah. Ooh, that's a good card for me because maybe he'll check. I check. Sure. Please check. Please, please. I beg you. One time. All right. I try. Thanks, man. Sure. Nice. Four. Three one time. Really important for Phil that he doesn't get to see Daniel's three eight. hand. Three hits. I'm going to so big. Night. It's <laughs> I'm going to overbet the pot for three comes. <laughs> <laughs> That's no good. I check. Oh, Six. Phil got there. Damn it. He hit the queen. That is 24,000. I really feel like you hit the queen. I was lying. I don't have five six. <laughs> <laughs> That's the bad news. <laughs> Could have used a three or eight. In three or eight, I would have won. Yeah. Yeah. I think the queen might have beat me. You check ace high for sure. You have to. Why would you bet? That would be really stupid to bet ace high. Is he sleeping over there? No. 
the math says I'm supposed to call, but my brain doesn't. Call. Cool. Good queen. Yeah, I know. Stupid. I know. He had to call. You said kudos to try and find a fold, but there's just certain yeah, things you can't do. It was like 100% sure. It, poker, right? There was like 80 billion in the pot, and I paid it off like an idiot. Well, be a, a wonderful lay down. I just do it. Stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. You just played it like that. Huh? You just played it to check call. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That would have been the strong move. Well, but he had actually had a hand, so you understand. Yeah, I had a jack. Yeah, but if he thinks he's got a queen, then... That wasn't well, sure. How can you be... Yeah. So far, you haven't pulled a queen. You just get mad. And Luke is really good about both folds. Fold. Reacting according to the line he puts his opponents on. He just does Raised it. To 11, yeah. He's, he has been, he seems to be just really zoned in on people's, what, two cards people have, doesn't he? Oh, I mean, pretty good. Been a couple spots in this Premier oh. League where logic should have oh. dictated someone was strong and they were weak and he knew it and vice versa. By the way, I, I call me a nip, but I would oh. just fold ace jack off suit to a raise in the earlier position. Replay. I just fold. I just fold. I would call Ace Jack suited, probably, but it's gonna be tough to play a big pot with it, like right now. Like, what do you? What are you yeah, gonna do? Yeah, yeah, hey, you hit your hand, and you're not even happy about it. <laughs> if you have Ace Jack, That's you're happy 6, that the Queen's there versus the lower card. Should somebody have the Ace in their hand? Well, if they had Ace Queen, they had you beat anyways. So you know, if it came Ace Deuce Deuce. This is interesting because Phil's bet six into 35, and if Luke makes a big move here, Safina might get blown out. Correct. I mean, he will definitely get blown. If if Luke raises here, he wins the pot on. He just plows through the hole. And yet, is it smart for Luke to make a move here overall? It's full. Well, this now it's a. Tr no, I wouldn't have done anything if I was Luke. Um, could be Queen Six. He's up against whatever. Triv call. Triv call. I would not raise. Keep the pot small. Raise to thirty thousand. I don't like this raise. Full. It's it does the job because he's against twos. <laughs> It's no good when you don't hit. You can't win the pot. <laughs> the only hope is to get lucky. <laughs> That's bad. <laughs> That's bad, he says. <laughs> That's bad. No, I think I started with the best hand again. Yeah, I sure did. Got it's run not down. how you start the race, right? <laughs> yeah. No, it's not how you start the race. Well, Safina's got over 600K. Giovanni is, right now, most comfortable player at the table. He's got the most yep. points and the most chips. <coughs> and Whoa. so remember that, guys at home, when you, you have like an, an ace jack or an ace queen, it's and if an ace comes, you, you actually want the other I mean, card on the board to be higher than your yeah, kicker. And the reason why is if they have that ace, an ace with that kicker, they've already oh. had you beat anyways. You're worried about the cards below your kicker. Because those are the ones oh. that may have made two pairs. If I to outrun cool. I Fraser's quieted down. Daniel, this is Helmuth and the Granu. I might do. Round no, three. Like this time Daniel's in position <laughs> from behind <laughs> the button. Yeah. What do you call that? Auto C bet? Oh, I know that. Yeah. Uh, they check. both missed. Yeah. Uh, 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 Phil checked in the dark. Daniel's checked behind. Is he done with this hand? All those face cards come. Usually, a guy calling out a position means some sort of face card or whatever. That's Looks like it's a fold. That's fine. It, and it's pretty interesting. Helmut and the ground to keep going at it. They really have to be aware of the other one. You know, one of them is not getting out of relegation, and maybe one of them is. I wonder if the, how, what's the ground stack? It's two thir See, I wouldn't with two thirteen. I'm trying to think of what I was doing. Was I raising fold. with like kind of goofy hands near the button? I was trying to fold. I was trying to develop. I was trying to fold a bunch, but I didn't. Fold. Did I? I played a lot of fold. What Daniel says, and I agree with about you, is that you nine. You open Raised a lot of pots, nine, but it's though. not so predictable where it's always from the cutoff no, and you the just button. Want me to call You'll and open goofy it, right? hands <laughs> early, middle, so it's much harder to get a line on you. The range. Right. Uh. Yeah. Right. But I'm, I play really careful after the flop if a guy calls. Which is what he did there. He had the 9 6 arts. He didn't connect. He let it go, you know. Check. 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 Tony G, Check. big blind, is now checked twice with the ace. And. 11. Has he got Phil pounds. in trouble here? A little bit, but it's. Remember, these are small oh. pots right now. At least pair the ace, dealer. 
Don't say that when you just let go. Check. Wow, Phil's gonna bet for value here and no. jump out of his seat. It's so weak not to value bet this hand, but. Value bet. Do it. Show us the hard and commitment to value better. Sure. You know what? You're checking, right? I got an ace. Ace 10. Oh, it helps yeah, loses the pot, but it feels like he got one there, huh? Should I hit a queen at the end? No, no. I had a pair. Thing about value betting? Yeah, you could have a four, or five, or a six, right? Yeah. Easily have a four, or five, or six. I only raised five. <laughs> You knew where you were, right? You knew that's what I had, Ace. Obvious. When I just called you, No, right. I didn't know that. I mean, I looked good that I checked it, but... It's a fun battle, boys. It's a fun battle. We're warring for points. So just looking at Negrano and Helmuth head-to-head, -head, what do the stats say to you? Uh, Helmuth is, like, crazy daisy mode. And that 100% steal attempt. I mean, I know it's only been 42 hands, but the players have noticed, and that's why they're through that. Yep. And well, that's how it works they adjust it. You got schedules and things. The fuel helmet rule. Blind's going to three and yeah, six thousand now, out, and they? they've got to ask themselves, am I doing enough? I'm especially thinking Daniel Negreanu, <laughs> Phil Helmet, four and six <laughs> points <laughs> respectively. If they go out in seven, it is not enough. They're going to have to win to get in their last match. Should I do? No, I don't. Oh well. Hopefully it wasn't. Okay, I bet nobody meet at it. and Giovanni. You don't want to hide? <laughs> What's that, 14? 14. Stick to our day jobs. And you know. if Daniel calls here, it's with the <laughs> idea of trying to take the pot later. Purely to float. float. In fact, you like the song, you hate the voice. I mean, yeah, one the right, one the left. Raised to 25,000. <laughs> Stick to poker, guys. Now, Pure second pair. Mode. Stick to our day jobs. I but know. if you're Safina here, what percentage of the time does Negrano have a king? You always swap a king when you have a hand, like no matter what. Because I've watched all the shows, and you have the top pair in every hand you play. It's pretty it's cool. Safina's cool. like it. my opponent might just have a flush it's so draw. So awesome to watch. I'm okay. impressed. Um, now they I both check. have a flush draw, and Negrano catches a pair and a flush draw, so he checks. A club would be not fun for Negrano. Oh wow, a straight just rolled off for Safina. Great card for Giovanni. He's slightly concerned that his opponent might have a flush draw, but oh. it's check call or bet maybe call a fold. It's fifty thousand. <laughs> that was a big turn card for me too. Yeah. Oh. That was good. Yeah, that's good too. That's all good. When you, no, 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 King, you, uh, you flop a lot of pairs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that's creepy. It's the seventeen thousand. This is starting to get to nitty gritty time for both the players. 223. Luke just loves it here in the number 223. This could be a cooler. It's going to be Helmuth. 45 coming in here. How can Helmuth pass? He's been three bets so many times. This is the best right. hand he's had. It's true. Could you see him shoving? Well, if he had the luxury of reading the uh, blog and see now. all the fishiness that nice Schwartz was up to in the past, he might. <laughs> And you know, in the breaks, people can uh, see what was happening in the, in the just not, not too distant past. This is huge inflection time for Phil Helmuth. Huge. This could be his Premier League. I'll show you when you fold, just so you don't think I'm just playing with you. Bubble comes good with the talking sometimes. When you fold. <laughs> I'm all in. There he got oh, it. Oh, he got him! Bubblegum was partially responsible for that all-in, like at least 4% of it. He can't pass. He can't pass. You I'll show you when you fold. How much more is it? <laughs> <laughs> it's one of those, he's sickened, but he's going to call. 200. Wow. I've seen Bubblegum make some of the best folds ever, but 
I don't think he'll be able to find a fault here, which is good, because he's crushing his opponent. But I'm gonna have to cool, but yeah, because he's like, oh, I could be against queens. He's jack. Called? Yeah. Any other tournament, I'd snap it, but it's just points. It's just a bit weird. You've obviously never got ace queen in a million years, have you? Now Phil is in the basket. <sighs> It's interesting, earlier Bubblegum said, oh, I have to call, but he hasn't, I guess he hasn't called. He says you don't have ace queen in a million years. <sighs> Fuck it. Wow. Yeah, you have to. He's made oh the call. Lord. Of course you got Yes. <coughs> what are you thinking? Let's get the tricon. <laughs> 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 I love Tony G. Like it was a good call. Queen's coming, and you, you, you're a hero. It was a good call. Call. It was a good call. Let's, like get, him him out. Let's like get him out. Let's get him out. Let's get him out. The trike's there. It's just a point system. No, it's fine. I mean, anyway, for making the play, for the helmet, you get the award of the day. They've come over the top. You might get lucky and win it. But all you deserve is a trike with a monkey on the back of it. Everyone knows a queen's coming. Sorry. You don't even deserve to ride the trike. Are you uh, taking sure of the worst? An embarrassment. I know a queen's coming. I take even money on it. Let me, let me bet. <laughs> no. uh, this is what I want to learn from. I've lost like, you know, 90% yeah, of the races for the last 15, 20. I think a queen's coming. That adds like 7% at least. <laughs> it's Luke doing I'm the really runaround, doing the walkabout. I don't think a queen's I see the queen of hearts, by the way. I think it's going to come king, king, deuce. I'm just going to. He's gone behind the table. You think he's taken up. Really bad strategy. He's left poker. the studio. He's. You think he's given up four percent here, Phil? Two to four percent walking away. This could be the end of Phil Hellman's poker career. All right, on the count of three, we all scream. Oh! This is This is how legends are made. The queen comes, and you're a legend. I mean, that's the right price. Dash, I feel like exactly. I'm stealing from you because I feel. <coughs> I'm all in now. Queen of Hearts. Ace I don't know if the king's coming, queen. so don't, I'm not saying you're helping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think I've got ace king, he's got ace queen. Go? I can't watch us, too sick. Hey, what are you doing, left? <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's, he's, yeah, he's, he's telling he's his girlfriend at the bar. Somewhere. Somewhere. I have so, so, can't seen watch. Seen what was the flop? Yeah, oh, fuck that, flop it, man. I don't want to fucking watch out. I'll tell you what got me to put the money in, though, when he said, I'm going to show you. Yeah, he got you to do that. Yeah, yeah, because I thought he had, you know, he nines or weak. eights or something. Right. Yeah, yeah. Kind of weak. Nines or eights or eights. Right. 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 Tony's torturing him. I think you got the chop. Ace. <laughs> it's a chop. No, kicker plays. No, Tony knows. Tony knew that the, the whole match. time. Match. Tony was. It's a chop. Oh. You know what you got to do in the last one, match, Andrew? Let me get you the bike, Phil. The second place. You gonna ride the bike? Uh, ride the bike. Timoshenko did it. Do it for the shot. Well, I can't ride that thing. No, no, you big bike. So big bike. Yeah. Here you go, I'm second. Nasty. Tony's in heaven. Get he the bike. puts them all on the bike. He's got eight points <laughs> right now, Phil. <laughs> second would be what you need. Certainly not Phil, mathematically out. Phil does not oh, want to the ride the bike, out. but Tony's bringing it out and saying it's good TV, go. and Phil on Don't the bus making good TV, so he's got to get on the bit. bike. Oh, no. He's getting on You're the bike. You're a sport. He is. A sport. Yeah, I, have a bad, I have a bad feeling. See, I'm going to go right down those <laughs> no, steps. No, 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 I am. I'm, I'm telling you. you. No, I'm let go. Done. Let go. I'm telling you. I'm going right down the steps. <laughs> he is a good oh, sport. I used to be kind of good when I was a kid on a bike, so I'm going right down the steps. I'm telling you. the monkey in the back. <laughs> it's all right. I'm coming up uh, for a one and a half Whoa. million dollar tournament. It's all right. <laughs> In the Ravello bar. Everyone's a winner. I take the cool exit. I just saw him riding the bike. I knew it was good news. <laughs> he, saw him, he saw him riding the bike. That's how he knew he won. You actually had a sweat on the turn of a chop. It seems like I never catch a break. Um, but I didn't have to put the money in with Ace Queen. So you got to say, all right, look. You know, I mean, it was just kind of a weird situation. It would be nice, you know, this is getting old. I mean, it's been like eight or nine or ten Premier Leagues in a row. I may have lost every single race in eight, nine, or ten. Maybe I won two and, and lost 18. I don't know exactly, but it's, it's becoming, you know, a little bit like, what? And wow. a gutsy call by Luke. I mean, because yep. I would say easy, but um, gutsy considering his yep. point standings. He knew. But look at how Luke... Coaxed that all in. It. By, well, he increased the chances by 
but it's three to ten percent for sure. Oh, two point two zero, right? I was. Cool. Now one point behind me. Walk. I'm saying so. Three to six. Is that a call? Yeah, it's a call. 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 And uh, JC's been really quiet. Okay. Yeah. That'll do for you can me. fold. You can't fold if you're not there. You can't fold your house. Okay. Three players. Obviously, Tony was hoping he would get to re-raise round the back. That hasn't happened. Right. This is not a good flop for Ace King when you just limp limp. King would be a killer card here for G. You know, the Ace King, he... Check. Check. Six I would have bet the nine. Oh, look at this. He's getting the max now. Ian can, uh... I would just call. Yep, this is good play by Ian. And check call the river? Yeah. Yeah. Because now you get a guy to fire when he puts you on clubs or hearts. And now the ace will probably check just thinking, I, I, I may be good. He might just call thinking the ace high is good. Ian's really locked in. He's pretty zoned in, isn't he? Yep. I mean, he knows he's trying to get called by ace high. It sure feels like it, yeah. I like Ian's line on this hand. How can Tony G fold it? Wow. Oh. Strong. Oh. This? Strong. Nah. He's showing it. I don't like showing it. Oh, he just showed one card, didn't he? I think he, he must have showed the king. Just now the king. he showed the nine. I don't know. Things not looking good for Helmuth. Just the two points. He does, however, have a match left. Of the six remaining, Safina and Luke Schwartz doing well. All eyes, though, on the bottom of the league, Fraser, Tony G, and Negreanu. Luke Schwartz because has 14 points, but a game, game in hand. Spot. It yeah, looks exactly. like him and Safina you know yeah, are locking up the top the four spots said, along with yourself you. and Benjamin. You yeah, when that's the way that's it's headed for sure. That's what got him. He thought you had like nines or tens. If and I would like that as a, from a strategic point of view. I I feel like I have a line on how they they think that's about the game, is one of those hands which helps. You hate showing in with us. Whose turn is it? Safina with the ace three, just sort of picking up the pace, and Negreanu's. He's really had to play through Safina, hasn't he? Yep. Um, uh, this is very interesting. The whole cool. thing he, that's happening here is cool. weird. We got a limp with ace three, which... Oh, no, it was a raise. raise. Sorry, it was a raise. Okay, that makes sense. Raise, call, call. Oh. Tony G's going to call. It's, it's I, might, I, cool I would definitely you. consider calling with a lot of these hands. I mean, the 10-7 of diamonds, maybe not so much, but the other ones I kind of like. There was this dynamic, I think, where <coughs> Negrano considered re-raising, but it's been he's been doing so poorly isolating Safina. Yep. Nice flop for Daniel, though. How do you play? I mean, I flush draw? he's going to bet. He has two over cards and a flush draw. The thing about the raise play is I like to only use that against a predictable, straightforward, weaker player. That way you can get them in the pot and control what's going on, know what's going on. Against somebody who's obviously demonstrated their understanding of the game, like Sorry, Safina, man. I don't like I it so much. Just about 167. Daniel oh. cannot oh. fold to a shove here. He is putting right. his whole tournament on the line. Cool. But it's, he's right to, right? Yeah. The question is, if he misses on the turn, what then? Oh. Good luck, back. sir. That's whatever you need. Wants a 9, 10, or a blank. That's kind of a blank. I mean, uh, it looks like a blank. To I'm me. all in. All in. Oh, he See, took the move he, away from him. Right, he waited for a non-heart. Now, he might be able to fold this. No, See, no he doesn't have enough money to fold. He, he has too little now. money. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> nah. I need an eight, wow. jack, or a heart. Be cool. Oh, you could have folded that. Nah, not anymore. So. Not with a hundred left. <laughs> not with your points either, right? No, it's got to go for it. He knows he needs a big score. He got it! He got it. Oh, my Lord. Wow. Tony G must be sick. He made that call pretty quickly. 105, 110, 111. And, and, and uh, Tony G did a smart thing. He said, I'm going to dodge the heart, and then I'm going to go all in because I have a real hand. And 
You know, so Ace Queen Hearts Jack. will be in a tough spot. Too easy. <sighs> Tony G's Premier League has just gotten dashed. At least I read, I read the part correct. I put yeah. you on a flash draw. I read it's it only a difference between three and four points for me to wait one spot. It's only one point, you know. Yeah. So I felt like. Oh, I'm happy. I mean, I'm happy. Yeah, yeah. I knew where I was in the park. That's what Even I put. Even if on the flop you did it, I wasn't folding up. No, the flop was no value for me. Yeah. Why? I knew where I was. Ooh, right. holy cow. You know Joey what? G doesn't right? waste any time, and I like this. He Never deserves this. He oh, deserves yeah. this. He's hoping that Thanks, there's boss. a real hand. Second place. That's what you need tomorrow. My blind with the three. Hmm? I think he needs a second. You need a second, I think, tomorrow. Like, nothing but. I don't think a third will do it. Gets you. But it gets you the wrong 16, because you'll have no seconds or first, and evgeny has got two thirds. So you lose up. Premier League Four continues from Las Vegas' famous M Resort after the break. This is the Party Poker Premier League Poker 4 coming to you from Las Vegas. 12 of poker's best have been battling it out in this league format, accumulating points based on where they finish in each match. Now just two matches remain for this season before the league standings are complete. The top four players for the season go straight through to the final. Those in fifth through eighth play heads up and the bottom four are sent packing. Now back over to your commentary team of Phil Locke and Jesse May. Phil Locke. There's six guys at this table and Fraser, Schwartz, and Giovanni, they want a ladder. You know what yes. I'm saying? And Tony G, Negreanu, and Tran, they need top two. They need, yeah. Here's 17,000, hold. Hold, hold. Into the blinds now, Safina and Negreanu, only one left. 11 more. Only if you want to. I would call with this hand. It's Got the chips to play. And it's 40% of a straight flush. Well, yeah, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> what are you supposed to do? You can't be folding that stuff, you know? It's not video poker, man. How about that when you made a royal flush on, was that, were you in the, yeah, it was, it was a royal WSOPE. flush on board? Wow. Holy cannolis. Time for Negreanu to bet. Yep, and I think it's gonna go fold or call and then fold. If he calls here, he's, he's calling to fold the river if he gets. Traditional that if you check the ace high on the flop, you're calling a, a turn bet. Turn, and then you, you, then you decide on the river. More often folds if the guy bets again. But right now Negreanu's just hoping that a diamond doesn't peel off but like he would want him. He's thinking Tran has probably a jack, like King Jack or something. Queen Jack, he's praying that his opponent had Queen Jack. I wonder if he thinks he can induce a bluff with a chin high. You just, you just bet for value here. Cool, I was hoping he had big hands. JC doesn't cool much. I just lost the straight, that's all. <coughs> just a straight. Nah, if you had Jack Queen, you would have called it, right? <laughs> you pay me off a Jack Queen? If you had Jack Queen, would you have called the river? You just couldn't say down no, there. He has a straight. I, I probably, I have to tank and then just. You just paid off. Crying call. You <laughs> 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 won't die. I mean, you might <laughs> shatter your face it's a little hurt bit. Hurt a little bit. A couple cuts here and there. Maybe a little bit. Oh. Reach a Y and back. Here's the 18,000. Every time Safina raises, you can oh. see Negrano and Tran having thoughts. You know, do I play a pot with him? Is this is is it time to re-raise? And he is getting I, action, yeah. Giovanni. He's getting action and he's collecting hands too, and they don't like raising him because he's more they, he's already demonstrated a propensity and an ease in calling with hands that some pros would fold. And he's got the chips and the position in the league right now to kind of do that. It makes more yep. sense. Yep. Cool. So no I think all these calls are justified. You know, they're all hands that can win big pots. 
G's only on 150k back. Check. 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 That's 20,000. Ooh, good bet by JC. You got about like 370, 380 in. Yeah, it's pretty much just uh, the really? standard three spades come on the flop no bet. See if I like 400, huh? See if I can win it now. So or the first person down. to bet these flops usually wins them. Good start. Hard to believe that Giovanni's check to do anything but fold, but wow, would he? I would think he? he? Well, he's, if he calls, he's putting his opponent on ace of spades, like you know, queen of clubs, and he's just gonna try and dodge a face card, hit like a eight of hearts or a. Oh my. Wow, this is so... How strong is that? This is just... Wow. This is great. And, you know, if you think that your opponent's the type of guy that's just going to fire anytime there's three spades out, this is a great countermeasure against him. <laughs> Did you see JC just sort of shake his head there? Yeah. I mean, he can only do anything... By the way, no. JC is 100% folding, but he doesn't want to snap fold because it gives his opponent the opportunity to think, well, what was he up to it? He doesn't want the other guys at the table. You're not a believer like Phil Helmuth that great players know when their opponents are bluffing? I mean, uh, not in this spot. The math is just too overwhelming. That's easy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. You're always right, Phil. Luck. The math is too overwhelming that he could be bluffing with a hand that has you crushed. Did JC lose the ball? No, just that he has the hand. Amazing. The guy check raises. Who's check raising Amazing. with three yeah. spades without a lot of parts. minimum ace of spades, queen of clubs? That's Giovanni Safina. <laughs> I mean, JC doesn't really have much to be worried about. If he goes out now, he'll have 20 points, which is guaranteed top eight. Uh, if he goes out fourth, you know, he's still only going to have 23 points, and that's probably not good enough to get to the final table. So with 100,000 right now, I mean, he's, he's got to go top two. He has to. And it's blind on blind here. JC has had a lot of opportunities to lose chips in this heat. And he's held on to a few, but he's still short. Check. Check. So, so in these small blind, big blind confrontations, check. when they both check, uh, at this point, you get queen high can start thinking he might be good. Uh, I think JC Tran's going to make check. a little... It's a really hard for the queen high to call here, but... It looks like JC just made like he's value betting a, a three jack. I'm kidding. <laughs> I want to make sure I didn't have a flush. <laughs> that would be nice. Yeah. Move that and then you right. show and then I'm value betting a Because you wins. might value yeah. bet a three jack. <laughs> or like try and get an ace to call kind go, of thing. And then he raises me and I go, oh, that's what you think. I say, I'm going to pound you back, right? So I take the call like this and I go like this and then I just throw the other. I put it in like this and then I go like this. Oh. He wants to call a string bet on me. So what happened? No, they, they ruled in my favor, but he thinks it's a joke. Like. The point is, I said pound you back. It's like, yeah. well, that doesn't mean raise. Like, it's... And you weren't even pulling an angle either. Well, like what angle? There's only heads up. I know. I mean, what am I going to do? Just like... 12. Raise to 12,000. You see everything when you're on the tournament trail, don't you? I mean, yep. that's the point. It's like, what angle could I shoot when I'm In late position, position I, I like this. You know, you're raising... Raise him. Like, what uh, you get a reaction? He, he With 40% of a straight yeah, flush. Whatever. It's like... You got a king nine. I'm folding a king nine. Are you? Sure. Yeah. Out of position. I hate being out of position. Oh, it's the big blind. It was only six more to call. I might call just six more. There's a. It was a button, so that was a big blind. Yeah, I'm gonna call for six. But I'm gonna be sick about it. Oh my gosh! What a flop! Holy cow! They both have big hands. Now we have a straight flush draw and a made flush, and a straight draw. I see. I see. If yeah, this is very strong, but you have to bet. This is a great bet. Phil, they both have 80% of a straight flush. They do. Oh my lord. They both do. If the five of spades comes, it's just gonna be a sick cooler. Now he doesn't like wow, the call. Wow, he passed! The, no, he didn't, did he? He did! And, I mean, the only reason you can pass there if you're Fraser is because it's not tactically right for you to get involved in a big pot. Like, but if that's true, why call before the I mean, flop? Right, I think... The call is yeah, either way, easy, but if you call, you have to continue with that flop, I think. Yeah. You, have you just have to. Yeah. What can you be happy about with King Knight on the flop anyway? I mean, I would just call. 
I'm gonna lose money if a straight card oh, comes. Oh, like I see a lot of guys limp with aces and go broke. Yeah. If you limp with it in the board oh, mission. The flop is jack seven deuce. Okay, go broke. <laughs> so what if it's jack seven deuce? You might have, you beat. Yeah. <laughs> you might have a set. That happens especially, sometimes. Especially in limp pots. You, it's yeah. it's more likely that, that that board hits the blind and anything. Luke's going and after the right. big right. blind. And you raise it, you came jack seven deuce. Okay, all right. Okay. I see how you can go broke. And Luke hasn't played a hand in a while. Limp. All right, buddy. Good luck. Yeah. This is an okay call. I wouldn't raise, of course, but squeeze opportunity. No. Fine. They raised to thirty. What? They just called. He's called. Cool. He's called. Cool. 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 Everyone's calling. Twenty-three. I was like, who are we raising? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't have that kind of hand, y'all. Three players. <laughs> you know? just got big pot ribbed all over. <laughs> Three guys buckled down. We see some face cards. Ask and you get what you ask. Check. Holy Check. Cow. Check. Everyone oh. caught a piece of this. I mean, this is How just much? crazy. I said all right. Oh. Check. How much I said. You like <laughs> the check from Schwartz? Yep. Is Negrano? Oh my oh lord. Oh my lord. Check. Now Negrano has a pair and a flush draw, but Schwartz. Bet fifty thousand. Loves to say. Raising is tough because you. It, you just get clobbered when the guy has you drawn to call. It's a careful play. I don't mind calling, but you have oh. to fold when a club comes. That's and a sick thing. I mean, Daniel cannot be thinking that's so impossible it's for Luke to have two pair here. It, right. it's, it, it looks like a flush draw, a straight draw, that kind of thing. Daniel thinks he's ahead, right? He's Daniel thinks he's ahead. That's correct. It looks like a flush draw that called, or like queen with Check. some. Check. Luke's got a value bet here. This is definitely a value bet. He, he got a dream card in the river. It's a it's a thin value bet, but it's really important because you're going to get called by a king a lot of the time. That 50,000. Two pair. Cool. Oh, that's good. When you hit on the river? No, uh, mm. That's good. I had a king with a club. Yeah. It was a, it was a careful hand by both players, right? Yep. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I can do there. And you have a look at Luke Schwartz's chip history. He hasn't had any setbacks tonight. Nope, just steady cruise. The V chip is 19%, but his total aggression is 75, which is interesting, meaning he's playing tight, but aggressive is what that means. That's not that bad. And it's working. <laughs> it's not that was a real tough hand for Negrano. He just yeah. dropped, a, you know, a decent chunk. He's down to 320 now. Oh. Giovanni sailing at oh. 700 and Luke Schwartz oh. sailing at 700 as well. Now, if I was a true internet player, I'd call it an A7. No, I'm picking myself. No, I'm going to win. It's a good hand, too. King 8 suited yeah. with. <laughs> the, he was on the button, right? It's, it's and if you cover up Tony G's hand like here, you. is this a call with Ace 4? No, I wouldn't call. I don't think it's low enough. They don't realize that there's, there, there's certain times where you get to a certain stack and you're going to wake up. One deck is as cool as them. Wow. That's good news for G. Oh, you don't know what your other card is? King, yeah, I thought yeah, it was close. King Queen. But King Rag. Yeah. I'd buy, I want you out before him, that's the problem. Oh. Are oh, you trying to catch him? <laughs> <laughs> That's interesting. Right, Luke needs That's JC interesting. train out first. <laughs> you know, I want him out before him. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's not only about your points, it's about who you need to knock out. Yep. Everyone has their own motivation. And Luke Because if certain people die in a particular order, he's got, he's got it makes that much easier for you to get the points you need to get there. Luke is raise. most interested <laughs> in Tony and Fraser. Right. They're the closest ones to him. They're the ones who are looking to ladder hit. Right, that's the right way to explain it, yeah. Call. You know, we're the two big chip stacks, so there's not much point in getting involved. Heads up. <laughs> Set over set with the suits. Quads and flowers. Oh. Luke's made this 25, or? And Giovanni Safina, he likes to hit pairs. And they're right, they've p tagged him as a pair hitting genius, <laughs> not a set or aces guy. And he, it's true. Raised to 40,000. <laughs> 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 dribbling away. <laughs> you gave him the green light. I could do one of these big moves on you again, innit? Just like that. <laughs> innit? 
Why even bother calling my rose though? You're gonna be in top four anyway. It's what? For me. It's what? This board is for me. I know this board, but pre-flop. You watch me. Queen seven or some shit. Bullshit. <laughs> It's not like I don't have a bat, I've got ace-10. Like I've got ace-10, you know what I mean? Yeah, you've now. got a queen. Yeah. You've got a queen? Yeah. Yeah. Wait, he, if, there's a pair, if there's a pair that can be top pair, that's what he has. Oh, you don't have to look at well. the board. Oh, Even when he folds, he has top pair. It's he unbelievable. Queen eight to pretty dry, but, uh, you may never see another pair. run like this in another 100 years. <laughs> Welcome back to Premier <laughs> League Poker 4 in Las Vegas. I try limping all the time, just limp. It's not that bad because there's no answer. <coughs> it's actually very strong as well. The next player out play gets way, four points. He'll probably make it 35 uh, to 40. He has yep. demonstrated ability to, he likes to bet three extra more. Raise. Oh, but this one's 25. So real hands, he's betting more and less real hands, he's betting a little smaller. Or he's mixing it up. Or he's mixing yeah, it up. Yeah, yeah. I think well, you're sometimes right he though. flat calls with the ready. uber strong ones. I don't panic. Oh. We want so next time I raise your blind, I'm not just bluffing. We want you to get all the chips and win it. Giovanni as well for you, man. He can Luke tried to make a big bluff on Giovanni that didn't work. Uh, yeah. And it was based on just what you were saying. He said Giovanni only bets big when he's got it, and he bets small when he doesn't yeah, have right. it. Right. And it, it backfired on him. I, I wonder if Giovanni actually is mixing it up. Raised and, to and confusing out. people a little bit. Bold. I don't know. Bold. It's hard to break away from your patterns. It's one of the hardest things as a poker player. That's so I don't know how much experience Giovanni has playing cards. About actually, it's pretty impossible. Exactly actually, is it? Bet, break away from your though. patterns. No, you can do it. Oh, Luke likes this. Look at how sexy that looks. Wow, so beautiful. The grinders made a min raise here. Thirty big blinds. What's that? Thirty big blinds then, yeah. Punish the min raise, make it like 60. He wants to try and induce him into peeling off a flop, or does he want to mm. try and make a raise to commit him? What would you be doing here? Uh, black calling sometimes, or raising uh, to like 65, 70, maybe 50, even something lower. And is Daniel's radar up? It's just been so long already that he thinks Luke has got something big. Why not? Re raise 58,000. It's a perfect number. Because it so can it, it's a uh, Negrano stack at 286. It could be teasingly tempting to put in that 38 or whatever. I don't think it's 58 more. I think it's 38 more. 38 more. Yeah, it is 38 more. Boom. And, and it's tempting. Oh, wow, good pass by Daniel. That was yep. so much like when Fraser yeah. re-raised him, tight. except it's this two time two it was two kings. Two yeah. It's gonna cool, but. I had, a, oh, I wish you did. I had five, seven of diamonds and I would have loved to see flop. <laughs> oh. Oh. Raised to 23,000. And Luke putting pressure on JC's big blind. Oh. JC shown a propensity to peel off even with short stacks. Yeah, and I don't, I don't like that. I like going up with the raise or the fold. Yeah. Well, I should probably reserve my opinion until I have more tournament wins than JC Tran. You know, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's like maybe it's right. Oh. I mean, wow. Right? A six. I'm going wow, all in right? there. Uh, or folding. Oddly enough. Heads up. You might be different. You'd be worried. A bit worried. All right, I'll check. I'll check right in the dark for you. Check it dark. It's gonna be hard for JC to win this hand. <laughs> That's a straight dope. Check. And should that be an alarm bell for JC? No, JC might try and steal it. Cause it looks like Ace Queen, and maybe my opponent connected. That is 28,000. How much you go behind? <coughs> do I move in now or do I move in later? It looks like he should be. I mean, we see his hands and we know it's supposed to just 82. call. 82. <laughs> so he's thinking, well, strike call. I mean, it's overacting, but it still might work. Do a trick. 
All this acting, he can't go on the edge. He's, he's leading for just a call to let JC hang himself in the river with another bullet. And even though there are so many draws out there, Luke just says to himself, I'm calling two bullets no matter what. Yeah, if he calls here, he's just calling him whatever peels off. Good. This is, a, see, this is Luke, this is a fine play. People, this is just fine. I mean, it's, it's actually a great play. He's got him. He's too strong to raise, you know. Wow, now the problem is JC's going to obviously check because he now made a sure. hand. Sure. And now he'll fold, I think. As gross as it is, I think you have to go all in. Because you remember, you don't know that he just has a six. He might have, uh, you know, ace nine. or That is 90,000. That's what JC's got. And if he calls here, he's out. And with 21 points, probably going no farther than the heads up. I'm probably calling here. I can say tactically you're calling all the time because with his, yes. his 82,000. Top two. I would have barbecued you. That's what I'm talking about. Go on, guys. Luke. With his 82,000, J.C. Tran wasn't going much farther than sixth place. He's out in sixth. That's the end of his Premier League season, wow. but basically guaranteed, Phil, to be in the heads up and a chance at the final table. Completely. Wow. J.C.'s going to be in the playoffs. I've got J.C. out, and that is what I'm talking about. That's what you were looking for. That's all looking. I was looking for. Well, I slow played. He kind of had to go with most players. My hand didn't make sense. God, three five yeah. spades. I would have check raised you on the turn, you would have been sick, you would have beat me in the pot, and then I would have rivered you. Oh, now listen, <laughs> just stay away from me now. Alright? I will. Until well, we get heads up. Please don't go. These short stackers, yeah? You know what I'm saying? It's just smart. <laughs> <laughs> You're the best. Luke is trying hard. I'm just happy now we know, like, top three. Me or you. We... Huh? Top three will get you. And out. things you are starting to look a lot better for Ian I Fraser. Um, with JC out, the depends where you no, Fraser's guaranteed 18 points. Well, well, Ian Fraser, I, I think, just fold my way in. Fold. Needs one or two more spots. I need top three in the last round if I get out next. And he'll he'll be looking at the playoffs. Yep. He knows it. He is not going to move a chip. Yep, it's true. We get Daniel, then we focus on Ian. Negrano's for sure moving chips here. Italian. <laughs> wow, it seems so then dangerous then for him to call it. here. No, he's going to raise. Oh, Three raise. Seven seventy-two thousand. And you know, five-handed tens is a mo oh my lord, Tony G. I'm all in. Yeah, Three I'm say Tony G. Pretty team. much He's has in to. Trouble. Tony oh. is in yeah, big. Oh. Tony trouble. Super in trouble. Pair. Big tens. Oh. That's a seven. All in and a call. You got nine. Ah. Good luck. Wow. Hang on, where's the bike? No, I'm I need the bike. <laughs> I want the bike. Oh, I, do. <laughs> I could fall. <laughs> Tony G is going to have another match, but with four points here, he is going to be up I against it. Shit. So sick. What the fuck in hell? And for Tony G, for everyone left at this table, his knockout. I'll take a queen over a ten now. It's going to be a yeah, boost. Would. <laughs> that wouldn't be bad for you. Black time. Down to two outs. It's no outs. Yeah. Not even the jack. It's got to be the nine. Yep. Well then. All right, buddy. Good luck in the last heat. Okay. Tony G, not out of it yet, but like Phil Helmuth, in serious shape. Oh, I'm the worst. Oh, we're down it's to four. To I'm I'm the fourth four. coming in. So far, so good. Tony. He's gonna have to ride his own bike. He is riding his own bike out of there. <laughs> On my wish list, if you will. Can't avoid it. Well, Tony G is out of this match. He has one match left to play as well, though, so it's not over here. And there's definitely still a chance, at least, of getting into the heads up. How do you feel today went for you? Oh, it was terrible. I mean, I was unlucky against Daniel, and that was a big hand for me. I mean, just, just haven't been running good, and just need to run good in the last heat. If I get top three, I'm in the playoffs four players and Schwartz on top
And Ian Fraser, all of a sudden, it's looking like he's well, in. Yeah, he did what he was trying to do. He might shoot for the top two spots now. A win might even get him in the uh, final table. Next time, the fifth league match concludes as our Premier League stars feel the pressure to stay in contention for the top prize and the championship title. Oh, sit. No. Come on, the razor. This is way more fun when you hit flops. Yeah!